then we went to Crete, Greece, and beautiful views on the way to the hotel. I'm back. Thank you so much for being patient and understanding. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. My return video. Well, I had a great, great summer. Accomplished a lot. I, s I rested, spent time with my family, sent my uh, son to his first year, freshman year in college. It was spent, uh, went with my daughters to Greece and flew a lot. <laughs> Most important, I figured out uh, how to do my videos. Uh, got my uh, got garage set up. As, as you see right now, I, I had uh, a shared space uh, car garage and I got my own separate. So just a few days ago, I actually finished moving all my stuff into the new garage separate garage and they'll be doing a lot of installs, a lot of videos in that separate garage. So that is, that is actually very great. Uh, so let me kind of explain what was going on with my setting up my new place. Let me show you. This is the garage that I was given. Given because I did not buy. When I moved, I did not buy. I'm still renting. The plan is to buy this year, the next year or two. Hopefully when that's what I'm predicting. When pr uh, prices of homes are going to drop significantly. But I'm not a financial advisor. It's just my only opinion. Anyway. The new complex, which is beautifully uh, run and owned, I got a, a locate, allocated a garage, one car garage within, a shared within one, two, three bays. So pretty much this was my uh, setup and all my shit from uh, the previous garage was here, like between this lady's car and this guy's space and all literally all my shit was over here and i had to get myself a separate garage and this whole time management said yeah yeah august is when everybody moves so we promise you we'll give you a single car garage and that's what i'm doing right now i'm moving all my stuff to my single car garage right down there i'll show you and i'm going to set it up as a studio as a workshop a workspace whatever and that's where i'll be uh providing these great videos so warthog and gray ghost are moving into 21 all my stuff is being moved right now and it's my own private little little place you know when we moved from uh, that house that had a basement to this house there's no basement over here you realize how much you accumulate over the years a lot of the basement stuff Wife, she said, yeah, let's put it in the garage for now until we figure out what to do with it. So literally half of the stuff in the garage is not even mine. That's it, mission accomplished. Gray ghost <laughs> and warthog in the new garage, new studio. It's time to fix it up. That I'll do in the next day. It took me like two hours to get, get everything organized and make a nice little studio over here. Cool. Accomplished a few uh, upgrades on the bike on Grey Ghost. I put tap performance uh, pipes on. future I put new engine guards on the bike and okay I don't know where this part is gonna go in what video John has just gave me a gift check out his video a nice gift thank you John thank you so much and he's pretty much installing it right now it should be really cool let me show you what it looks like before and then I'll show you what it looks like after. Anyway, also I'm now uh, sticking uh, John's Cycle Fanatics sticker right here. Yeah. 
So let me show you after John worked his magic. Looks really, really nice. Really, really nice. Look at that. Screaming Eagle, fat, 10 gauge, I think that's called. Supposed to help a little bit with performance and looks. Very nice little touch. Thank you, buddy. I rested, spent time with my family, sent my uh, son to his first year, freshman year in college. This is check-in day. Uh, Daniel, my son, is starting college his first day, dropping all the stuff. Was spent, uh, went with my daughters to Greece. So I did come with my kids, uh, spent time with them. We went to Crete, Greece, and beautiful views on the way to the hotel. Take a look, they gave us the smallest car, the Fiat Panda. It's got six gears and it's like, I don't know, 800 cc. Look at the view. Hi, is it okay? Oh, look, they got wind, wind, wind milling. Tavern over there. See it uh, on the water. Where I just Oh, One side is a cliff, the other side is the ocean. And uh, the narrow one lane, single uh, lane road. It's good at sunset in a few seconds. What's the cheapest color? Melo. Melidoni Cave. The right there. It's a water drop right here. Stalagmite. Oh, beautiful. This is beautiful, huh?
vacation and treats. Treats so it's great. And flew a lot. I flew a lot of overtime flights to fill up that bank account after COVID, get the reserves up. So I, I literally took a lot of uh, overtime flights and I flew a lot, a lot, a lot. So what was I doing while I was away from YouTube? Flying a lot, flying a lot. This is a, one of our aircraft, it's uh, color painted in retro style. It's a special flight today because I'm flying my niece. My niece is uh, 14 years old. She's flying from Israel to summer camp in America in Pennsylvania. So it's going to be cool. Changing oil. So yeah, I will try, I'm back in business. I will try to keep one or two videos per week. And I don't wanna uh, like uh, over promise. I prefer to uh, under promise and over deliver. Like you see, even my schedule is very, is very flexible. And I don't know in advance if I can you know, attend certain rallies or certain meetings or certain uh, events. That's why, see, like this year, I actually uh, plan to go to Sturges. I got time off and everything, but circumstances just didn't work out. And I, I missed, I missed pretty much uh, the travel, the trip to Sturges. So that's why I don't promise way ahead in advance if I'm going to be going to a certain rally. I prefer you know, to surprise, I prefer, you know, like I said, to uh, under promise and over deliver. Let's put it that way. Yeah, guys, I want my last video had to do uh, with a shout out to Zohar, uh, the young kid that was uh, trying to inspire other younger kids with disabilities and your reaction and your sharing and your uh, subscribing to her and giving her the support was really, really touching. I'd like to thank you guys so much. You should see uh, her reaction and uh, the family's reaction, the emails and the comments in the video. So thank you so much for supporting her, guys. It was really nice to see how you guys went out of your way to help and support her. I thank you in her behalf. Thank you so much. Yeah, guys. And I did get back to Israel to get some new merchandise. The tour pack raffle is still on. So I encourage you to go ahead. I think in a month and a half, I don't remember the exact date. We're gonna have the raffle, the raffle for the tour pack for the Advent Black uh, tour pack. The winner is gonna be getting uh, a, any choice, any color and any size Advent Black tour pack that you want. It's gonna be shipped worldwide. So anybody can buy uh, entry tickets. Go ahead, I encourage you to do it. That's it guys, I'm back. Thank you so much for being patient and understanding and all the support that I got. I got a lot of emails, a lot of comments. Thank you so much. You can find me on the Instagram, on my channel, and that's it. Hope you enjoyed this one. Stay tuned for more. I'm Sandy watching Holy Shift, guys. Till the next video. Peace out. Bye.